This week we say hello there to the Obi-Wan Kenobi teaser trailer, meet some new characters on the Halcyon, and more. I know this is inspired by Padme Amidala's travel cloak, which suggests when I got home from the Halcyon, I could have you know, taken it off, but I didn't. Because it's also good as a snack cloak, a TV watching cloak, a virtual meeting cloak. I'm just saying, don't let the name fool you. Sadly, it is not a telling you the news cloak. It's too dramatically distracting. So, let's get to the news. You wanted an Obi-Wan Kenobi series teaser trailer, you've got one. Yesterday we got our first look at the limited series arriving on Disney Plus May 25th, and it's a thing of beauty. In the teaser, we found Obi-Wan down and out working a job that is far less glamorous than being a Jedi, just so he can keep an eye on little Luke Skywalker. But then, the duel of the fates ushered in a looming threat, the Grand Inquisitor in live action, with all the lightsaber spinning goodness you would expect. There's also a glimpse of fifth brother and newcomer Moses Ingram as Reva, between the planet hopping to the new locale of Dayu and and the return of familiar faces like good old Uncle Owen, May 25th literally can't come fast enough. Check out highlights on the teaser, rewatch it for yourself, and keep your eyes peeled for intel on an Entertainment Weekly exclusive cover story with all new images, all tied up neatly with a space bow on StarWars.com. And keep your eye on the new at Obi-Wan Kenobi Twitter handle, which just went live and appropriately tweeted, you guessed it, hello there. Hands up if you can't read that without responding, General Kenobi. You, me, same. We still have nearly a month to wait for LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga, but today, StarWars.com gave us an exclusive first look at a new behind-the-scenes featurette featuring intel on building the complex environments that populate the trio of film trilogies. And it just wouldn't be LEGO without nods to the saga infused with lighthearted physical comedy like this bit. Get out of here! you'll never hear the Imperial March the same again. Check out the full feature at Building a Galaxy over on StarWars.com now. I can't tell you how excited we were when the armorer showed her helmeted face in the Book of Boba Fett earlier this year. To celebrate the return of the spiritual leader who uses the tools of her trade to make exquisite armor and bust some stormtrooper buckets when necessary, we sat down with actor Emily Swallow to discuss reprising her role and shouldering the task of enlightening Din Djarin and viewers at home about the weighty history of the Darksaber. Bust out your finest Beskar and meditate on StarWars.com slash this week for the full interview. And if you don't already have your tickets to Star Wars Celebration Anaheim, next Tuesday, admission badges will go back on sale for the general public along with the first exclusive merch from the event, including this t-shirt featuring the key art from the convention and an array of apparel celebrating the 20th anniversary of Star Wars Attack of the Clones. Then set coordinates for Star Wars Celebration 2022 from May 26th to the 29th. We can't wait to see you all there. We may be back from our voyage on Star Wars Galactic Star Cruiser, but we'll always remember the friends we made along the way. Not Lieutenant Croy. He kept trying to enlist me every time I complimented his hat. Tomorrow we'll give you a closer look at the colorful characters you'll encounter aboard the Halcyon, including Captain Keevan, Lenka Mock, and everyone's droid pal, SK-620. Sammy the Mechanic, who cares? He's the best. Songstress Gaia and her talented bandmate, Wani. Their manager and a delightful scoundrel in his own right, Wraith Cole. And D-309, the latest in a line of helpful droids who will sing you a lullaby at the end of the night or tuck you in with a bedtime tale. And also there's Lieutenant Croy. We may not be best friends, but he is our new favorite member of the First Order. Catch the next installment in the new miniseries Dispatches from the Halcyon tomorrow on the Star Wars YouTube channel and StarWars.com. That's it for this week, but for more on these stories and other news from around the galaxy, check out StarWars.com. And be sure to join us right here for This Week in Star Wars every Thursday. Thanks for watching and may the Force be with you.